What is going on, gamer type people? Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a little bit of U Boat. Hope you're all doing well. Hope you're having a fantastic week so far. Listen, if you're not, it's halfway over. We're halfway there, everybody. I want you to keep that in mind. Let's see who we got kicking around. VDK, what is up, my guy? Oh, hey, indeed. Mr. Portelli, oh, hoy. Absolutely. Mr. Retired, what is up? Uh, let's see now. What do we got? Yes, indeed. Retired. We have a flying U-boat now. It's interesting. It's a new mod, I think. Uh, <laughs> it's going to be good. Uh, Randy. I'm, I'm still a piece of garbage. garbage. I love that little ditty. I really do. Um, heard the release news. Dumped all your files. Good idea. Not a bad idea at all. Mr. Samurai. What's going on? Rock Bottom X. Hello, hello. Peace. And good evening yourself. What is up, everybody? B bro wow. B bro, what's going on? Hope you're all doing well. Welcome, welcome. Nice to see you all. Okay, let's go ahead and take stock. It appears we have a significant amount of water in the boat, which is unhelpful, is my feeling about it. Gotta figure out what we're gonna need. Need a couple of turpidus up in the forward. Imagine we're going to need a couple in the rear, too. We need one. One times turpidu for the rear of the boat. Galley's a little dry. A little dry in the galley. Uh, let's throw in some bread. And beef. No. Bread and cheese. Bread, cheese, and eggs. You're going to have breakfast sandwiches for days. Ah, why not a little bit of beef, too? Why not? Why not? Can I move any of these? Huh? Will these move? No, nope. apparently uh, they they weigh exactly six, a, a little more than six kilograms, so it's not going to work out. It's not going to work. All right, let's let them move that gear, and then we can do some other stuff. Uh, yeah, that'd be the mods. Uh, Michael, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. One week leave. Nice, my dude. Very nice. Randy's doing bad. Sorry to hear that, Randy. Sorry to hear that. Turtle, thank you very kindly. For posting the modular type list, I appreciate it. KJ, my guy, KJ, continue, continuously, without end, supporting this, this odd little thing that we've created together. 43 months in a row, KJ, of your life belong to me, and I thank you for each and every one of them. I do. I do, I do, I do. Okay. Now, we need stuff and things, even. Stuff and things. We'll take a few of these. Can't take any more of those unless I start a new stack. Uh, let's hold off for now. Let's hold off for a moment. We'll take more coffee. Hell yeah, we'll take more coffee. I love me some more coffee. He's good. He's good. It's not good for you, particularly, but I'll take it. We gotta take a crappy torpedo, which is sad. But it is what it is. It is a sad day for torpedo buying. <clears throat> Beef, cheese, and egg omelets on toast. See? It's all good. It's all good, my guy. Uh, Mr. Film, what's going on? Hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, everybody. We're all hanging out together now. Isn't that fantastic? Uh, I still, again, have 920 kilograms out of 750 kilograms. Not really sure what the deal is there, but I mean, whatever. Do you. You do you, game. I'm just, I'm here for it. I am here for it, game. Um, running low on beef. Might as well take some more beef. Why not? Ahoy! Ahoy indeed! Ahoy indeed! Send the boom! Seymour Fields! Listening on my drive home. No worries, my guy. You concentrate on that road. You make sure you stay safe. All right, let's start a new stack of parts, I guess. Maybe a stack of med kits, too. Doesn't seem like a bad idea overall. Um, we're pretty good. Like, we're, we're honestly overly kitted out. We actually have too much stuff, so this is fine. This is fine. What's going on here? We need three days for equipment production. Let's get started. Let's get started. I don't bother with the filters, no. 
I found that their usefulness uh, really went out the door right around, right around B127. They expire entirely too quickly. Like, you, you'll put 40 in there and they're gone in minutes. And it's like, well, what was the point of that? Plus, when I'm hiding, chances are very good that I'm not running the ventilation anyway. So I see them as a little bit of a waste of my time. Can we get a vacation? Of course we can. Go to Bavaria, people. Get your steins. Everybody, it's bring your own steins day in Bavaria. So we gotta we gotta get some steins. Let's get them. Sorry that I'm so washed out, everybody, but there's entirely too much light behind me now, so. So many newspapers. Equipment production completed. Yeah, buddy. Is there anything else I can do? I do have a leader. Um don't really need a stash done per se. Let's do aerial reconnaissance. Uh, look for defenses in the area. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. And take the rest of our 18 days off. Bring your own Bavarian. I like it. It's good. Maybe that'll help us avoid Duds V. It, it might be worth a shot. Maybe, just maybe, worth a shot. So many newspapers. Come on, game. Stay with me. So many. Oh, wait. Hang on. Secret. Oh, what? Neutral vessels in neutral escort. There is no objection to the escort of merchant vessels of whatever flag in neutral territorial waters by neutral warships. The escort of neutral merchant vessels by warships of their own nationality is sim similarly permissible. The escort of neutral merchant vessels by warships of another neutral power outside territorial waters is not to be recognized. Observations of this kind are, are to be reported without delay. Armed force, however, is not to be applied. What does that mean? So if, if neutral vessels are being escorted by neutral warships, we leave them alone? I'm guessing. Uh, yep, that's all UB stuff. Kill everything. I like it. V, v is straight to the point. I enjoy that. Oh my god, I still haven't gotten through my vacation because I keep having to stop and read stupid reports. Don't they know what vacations are? You don't do reports on vacation. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, okay? <sighs> newspapers, newspapers, catching up on the daily news every other week. Bump, bump, bump. Your hat is dumb. I don't like your hat. You got a dumb hat. I'm just saying. Just saying. It is what it is. What are you going to do? Um, did I get all the things I wanted? Did anybody remember what I wanted? I don't really remember what I wanted, so... Your guess is as good as mine. It looks like I have... Wait, did I get a torpedo for the rear? Did I do that? Did I do that? I didn't! My god, you people were going to let me go to war without a full complement of weapons. What happened, chat? What happened to us? We, 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 we were once a team. I want that torpedo and that torpedo. Let's get rid of this torpedo. And take this torpedo. Yeah. Yeah, that's better. Three hours. Oh, my God. Ugh. Your inbox never sleeps. I pity you, my friend. I refuse to be a slave to the great machine when I'm on leave. I refuse. Who is calling me? No, they're not. <laughs> I know. I know. It's not a very good work ethic, but I don't care. So, uh, Reconnaissance done. Might as well do some more reconnaissance, I guess. I don't know. It's there. We can do it. It's fine. Good. Okay. Um, can I get... What kind of favors are open to me right now? Uh, headquarters. Hmm. Increase officers to seven. I prefer six, honestly. I really do. I'd like influences. I'd like to be able to run multiple instances in the uh, headquarters. That'd be good. Let's take a peek at that. Then we can do more reconnaissance all at the same time. Ye boy. Okay, I guess we're going to talk to the man, see what we're going to do today. Where am I now? I'm in port. I'm in the port of Brest. 
The Port of Brest, Yellow Strider. The war's going okay. It's uh, January 41, you know, brand new year. Will's Ron, what's up, my guy? See more officers there. Is that also UBE? No, no, there's only six officers. That's, that's not UBE. That is not UBE, my guy. In favors. Oh, the ability to increase it to seven? No, that's in the base game. You are now on my sub. Hope you don't mind me putting you on my sub. Need an extra person. Absolutely, Will's Ron. I'm 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 tickled pink to be included, my guy. Absolutely, dude. Appreciate it. Alright, what does uh the guy want? Ooh, black pits open, people. Black pits open. As the cook? I don't think that's a great idea. Haven't seen eight officers in the base game. I didn't see eight officers here. I saw seven. Maybe I'm incorrect. Maybe I'm incorrect. I don't know. I, saw, I only saw the unlock for seven. Um, RAF Coastal Command has more aircraft. Weak point, though. Right there, baby. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Black pit. Mm. <laughs> there was a favor for eight. Okay. Uh, Southern Roots is open to us now. We got Portsmouth, Sector AM again, in the Met again. Aw, oh, I can't get to the Black Pit. It doesn't, won't give me a Black Pit one. That's poopy. That's poopy. I guess we're going back to Sector AM. I'm kind, kind of tired of hunting in there, to tell you the truth. It's pretty much everything I do now. Just go off the coast of Ireland. Go off the coast of Ireland. Over and over and over. God! I want to do other things. Bloop. That was a very significant bloop we had there, people. I don't know if you noticed that, but that bloop was magnifique. That was a bloop and a half right there. Bloop and a half. I should say. That's a great idea. That's a great idea. That's a good idea right there. I'm going to save. I'm going to do it. All your crew is named after Star Trek characters. I actually did a, uh, a series where all of my crew were named after Star Trek carriers, uh, characters. I did indeed do that. I feel the nerd vibe, my guy. It's all good. It's all good. I love me some Star Trek. Love Star Trek. Come on, game. You can save better than this. I believe in you. Should I should I give the hamster a, a Red Bull? Maybe the hamster in the wheel needs a Red Bull. Where am I? Ah. Uh, uh, I have to steer the boat before it destroys itself. Gotta steer the boat. Gotta steer the boat. La 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 la. Boat, boat. Um, I should probably make that turn a little wider, because this thing does not sail very nicely. Alright. There you go. See? Look at that. Good boat. Good boat. Oh, my guy. Getting better every day. It's like watching your children grow up. Except this is a little more nautically inclined. Inclined? Nope. I didn't say it wrong. You said it wrong. I didn't... I don't know what you're talking about. I have no idea what you're talking about. I don't know. <clears throat> um, Soft turns. You're right, V. You are 100% correct. Handbrake turn. There you go, my guy. Um, I actually saw a cruise ship do that once. It was in, um... Hmm... We were somewhere... Might have been, uh, might have been Barcelona. Can't remember now. I think it might have been Barcelona. Anyway, this cruise ship, massive, monstrous, huge cruise ship. That's what they did in order to turn around in the little port. Like, the port wasn't very big. When they got in the port, they dropped anchor and used the anchor as like a like a like a turning point. You know what I mean? It's actually pretty neat. I was like ballsy, super ballsy. <clears throat> Fire the helmsman, don't need him. Absolutely, get rid of him, get him out of here. Probably part of a union. <laughs> there we go. All right, we are both juking and jiving at this point. Uh, trying to make our way over to the black, well, not the black pit, to the, uh, to the western coast of Ireland. That's where we're heading. And we're going to go do stuff. Stuff. Possibly things along with that stuff. I don't know. I got a, fe I got a feeling that, uh, I'm going to be searching for a while to find boats. 
<clears throat> it's kind of sad that uh, the Black Pit is like now like accessible in the game, but not accessible to me. And that makes me unhappy. Makes me sad. I don't like it. Alright, we'll cut up through BF1. And then into our area of responsibility. Perhaps while we're in BF1, we can find something interesting to shoot at. Which would be nice. Not for them, obviously, but... Eh. To heck with them. To heck with them, I say. So how's everybody doing? Y'all doing okay? Y'all doing alright? Y'all doing okay? Let's see, each leg, that's 350, 314 there. Will I move to La Rochelle? Once that becomes available, yeah, absolutely. Will there be Irish coffee when we get there? Sort of delayed St. Patrick. I mean, I can't see why not. I, I, would, I would hate to think that uh, anyone would be deprived of their opportunity to uh, enjoy a day about snakes, I think, was where that all came from. Getting the snakes gone or something. Which is probably euphemism for like another religion, but I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Get on fairies that can spin around on themselves because they have engines. Yeah, yeah, 100%. I've seen those too. Um, I think, though, that these things need a little more maneuvering room for that, right? Conning Tower Cocktail Bar is open. What? Okay. Well, we didn't find anything coming up through, the, to, through Sector BF1, but that's because we weren't really traveling in the shipping lanes. <sighs> these things happen. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? If your answer to that question is pretty much nothing, that's what I would do, too. I'd do pretty much nothing in that scenario. It just is what it is. It's a thing that is a thing, and that's all. That's all there is. Okay. Well, we're, we're here now. So we can tell the folks that we've made it safe and sound to the place where we're hoping to shoot at stuff. And that's just dandy. I think that's fine. Did I re read the latest U-Boat dev post? I did. I did read it. I did read it. Yeah, it's definitely an interesting time, whether or not uh, it will be all that they say it will be. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not particularly fond of the idea of releasing it in a stage of betas, like testable betas, essentially. I'd rather they just, like, take the time, build the game, work out the kinks, and then give me the game when it's done. You know what I mean? Like, I'd, I'd prefer that. Uh, let's see. U-14 picked up a group of warships. Gross. Gross. I can do nothing with warships. They are useless to me. St. Patrick chased the snakes out of Ireland. Right, but I'm pretty sure that the term snakes is, is something else. I think... Pretty sure it's not actually serpents we're talking about. Breaking news from London. Um, the unescorted Zealandic uh, was hit underneath the forward mast by one G7E torpedo from U-106. Ship sank slowly after being hit amidships by two torpedoes. Okay, okay. Germans observed how the crew abandoned ship and three lifeboats. They were never seen again. Huh. U-96, hey! Chasing an unknown st steamer that had evaded three torpedoes. Oh. U-boat fired a fourth torpedo at the first steamer, but it was also evaded, and the boat forced to dive by gunfire. Oh. It had fired one at the Almeida Star, which stopped after being hit amidships, but did not sink. Uh, after being hit in the stern and amidships by two coups de gras, U-boat surfaced to shell the ship. Wow. This is dedicated stuff, man. I gotta tell you, Link, if you ever see this, you did a hell of a job, my guy. He really did. Possibly have no people to actually test. <sighs> yes, but then I would say release it as a invite-only beta rather than having everybody, like, rabid to get their hands on it. Because you, what you're gonna end up with is, is gonna be, like, a flood of things that are broken or things that aren't working correctly or whatever. And I think that's not a good call. I think they're better off focusing in smaller doses, you know what I mean? But hey, I don't know really much about uh, testing games and stuff, so... The hell do I know? I'm making it up as I go. 
Um, have you tried to destroy your game? Yes, I did. I have a couple of um, couple of um, videos on YouTube where I was playing it. I am very poor at it. It's entirely too quick for my poor little brain. Snakes were the Protestants. Oh. There are no snakes in Ireland, but this is really due to them not making it there before the sea level rose. This simple fact was... 100%. See, um, we have a province, uh, an island province, called Newfoundland. There are no snakes there either. No snakeies in Newfoundland, once again, due to the uh, the fact that snakes never got to go there. I um, was kind of hoping to catch a little something here. First dip of the day. We are right at the edge of the sector, though, so I can understand why maybe we're not picking anything up. Um, we'll move to the next leg here. Say there-ish. And do that again, essentially. Try it again. Try it again. Why not? Give it another go. Protestants were a thousand years after St. Patrick. I don't think that's correct. When was St. Patrick alive? <laughs> like, I feel like the, the year he was alive probably started with a one. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. Then again, I don't know. I, I'm not a historian. I prefer much, much, much older history, like thousand, like five, six thousand years ago kind of history. It wasn't St. Patrick from the fifth century? I don't know. I assumed it was around 11 something. I don't know. Late Roman period, 400s. Wow. I didn't know that. I'm probably going to forget that. I don't know why. It's just one of those things that I'm pretty sure my brain's going to go, nah. And it's going to remember something completely different for no reason. You know, like uh, the size of the tires on my sister's car or some silly thing like that. Oof, this is a. Oh. Oh, those warships up there. Get out of here. Get out of here, you losers. You're useless. Useless, no tonnage given warships, yeah? You guys suck. You guys suck. <clears throat> Do you ever get to go versus a small fleet? Picked it up on sale and dabble with it, kind of got bored with it. Do you ever get to go versus a small fleet? You can go against all kinds of size fleets. Little fleets, big fleets. I've seen one convoy of 98 ships, so. Uh, John. John. Nerf. I'm going to go with John. John, welcome to the channel. Thanks for that follow. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. All right, let's give this another go right around here. Another go right around there. See if we can find something to shoot at. I wants to shoot at. I feel like five minute dip is not enough for operator to locate. Yeah, the game is what it is though. I mean, what are you gonna do? That's how they built it. That's how they built it, my guy. I just work here kind of a thing. Right? Um, just grabbed the game a few weeks ago and your video has been super helpful. Fantastic, thank you. I'm so very happy to have helped you. I really do appreciate you saying so there, Alex. Appreciate it. Don't forget to like. What? <laughs> what? I'm I'm streaming. <laughs> I'm the one streaming. I can't like what I'm streaming. That's crazy talk. Y'all are crazy people. Do, 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 do. Maybe we should go further into the sector. Let's try this. Is all along here where I've found shipping before. Ain't no shipping. I don't know if you caught that, but they ain't none. And I don't like it. It makes me sad. And uh, it leads to lower back pain. So, I think Torpedo Depth was selected before rolling the torp, in, torp into the tube. But hey, it's a game. Um, Probably on U-boats. I could see... Hmm. Probably? I don't know. Um, I know there are presetters that you can use on... Maybe not more modern torpedoes, but like 1960s tech. You can you can set all that while they're... You just hook up an umbilical cable to the torpedo and you can tell it what to do, essentially. I, I really don't know how it would work, to tell you the truth. Don't forget to like to... Do, oh, well, thank you there, T-Rex. Appreciate it. Wolfgang, good afternoon to you myself. You, to yourself. 
Oof. Having one of those brain not braining kind of days, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate it, T-Rex. I do. I just misunderstood, my guy. I misunderstood. I'm thinking U-Boats game torpedoes. Um. Yeah, I, I'm not really sure. Yeah. I'm trying to think of how it, it like must like work even in the game. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. <coughs> 60 stags more. That it is retired. Hey. <coughs> <laughs> Wolfgang. All right, my guy. Okay, let's go this way, and then we'll go this way, and then we'll go this way, because we're not having we're not having good luck here. This godforsaken patch of water. I'm so tired of this stupid patch of water. I want to go hunt in other places, but they keep giving me the same stupid missions over and over. It's dumb ones. I need time to go by faster or something. More vacations, I think, is key. More vacations is key. Sub, ten, sub tender sailor for nine years worked on six three seven and six eight eight boats. Sea Wolf just came out before I before I stepped. Cool, my guy. I'm an air weapons technician myself. I've been working on torpedoes for about um um coming on fourteen years, I think something like that. <clears throat> Don't seem to have a button. I, I don't know. Honestly, I'm not sure what the viewing experience is, is like on YouTube. I tend to do my viewing on Twitch, so I really couldn't say. <laughs> Too long. You're not wrong, V. You're not wrong. Still have that cold? Not exactly. I have a cough that just it won't ever go away. And I've had it ever since, I don't know, 2021, I think, some, something like that. It's just, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. See, part of it is I, th I think I have what they what they refer to as a post nasal drip. Oh, hey, what's going on, gigantic convoy? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. What I'm talking about. Yeah, I like the way this is turning out. All of a sudden. Now let's achieve our objectives. Thank you very very kindly, V, for reminding me. If you request a new mission, sometimes it does sometimes do it. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. It does sometimes give give you the goods, just not often. All right. So I'm assuming that this convoy is going to be somewhere along this route. Is this this is more or less my established shipping lane? Oh, ho, ho, ho. hello, smoke. Hello, Smokey Smick Smokerson. Yeah, I'm excited now. We found boats. Mm, mm, mm. Found boats. Yeah. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm. Sometimes I freestyle. I wish I didn't. I'm sorry about that, but you know. Oh yeah, there's all the smoke. There's all the smoke. We're gonna steer like this. Steer like this. Um, or you can save scum. <laughs> You're not wrong. You're not wrong. You you might be able to save scum it and uh, get away with it. Oh, why? What is happening? Look at the way the smoke is going. I think I'm. I think I'm steering directly at them. I. Oh no 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 no. I tried to spin around the wrong way, and that would have been terrible. I would have been sad. Oh crap! They're a lot closer than I thought. La 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 la. Maximum back. Dive. Dive. Maximum dot go go dive dive go go okay 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 we're fine we're fine we're fine we're fine everything's fine everything's fine we're fine everybody relax I don't know why you're panicking it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay we're gonna be fine all right uh no start on that torpedo please number one please please and thank you yes alarm Oh, crap. They saw me. Crap. Okay. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're just going to stay still. We're going to be a hole in the water. We're just going to be a hole in the water. Everything's going to be fine. Everything's going to be fine. We're just going to be calm. <clears throat> well, that's in an interesting take, Martin. Um, you're 
you know. Okay. Mm. Uh, what do we got now? How much do the higher difficulties, higher realism uh, settings affect the game? I'm feeling a lot more confident in the game now. I don't really know what to expect. So, the higher in realism you go, um, well, I mean, first and foremost, the, the way your torpedoes work, or, or rather work and or not work, get a lot harder. Because they, they if you use a realistic setting for the torpedoes, um, that means they're going to dud out at the rate they would have back in the 40s. And they dudded a lot back in the 40s. Like, it was very, very poor tech at the time. So that'll be a thing. Um, darker nights makes uh, nighttime settings so dark that you you cannot see the enemy ships. You just can't. You know what I mean? So there's that. There, there you know, little subtle things like not having your detection hint over here, um, not having the little red line that like shows you where your torpedo is going to go uh, based on what you've got your settings set to, stuff like that. It's all very doable. You just have to put in the time, right? You just got to put in the time. Yes, Samurai, I believe they saw me, my guy. Yep, they caught sight of me uh, because uh, they were a lot closer than I thought they were going to be. So, it is what it is. It's a fair cop, Gov. It's a fair cop. Okay. Um, I really shouldn't do this. I'm going to warm another torpedo, and I shouldn't. Because they're all very, very close to me. But I really need at least one more, if not two more. So there's that. Yeah, let's let's push it. Let's go for broke. Um, we're going to be a little a happy little hole in the water. Uh, ship detection range is 75% on easy, 100% on medium, 125% on hard. That makes sense to me. Honestly, it does. Flee! <laughs> I like it. They should flee. They should all fear us. We are the evil that stalks the ocean. We are the evil that stalks the ocean. We will not be denied our uh, uh, shooty shooty bang bangs. We shall not be denied of the shooties. Oh, this is looking beautifully. In all honesty, I'm going to back up a little bit. I think I'm going to do that. Back up a wee bit. There we go. Stop there. Okay. Everybody's alarmed. Everybody's crazy. But that's all right. That's okay. We can make this work. Let's slide on up to uh, two zero meters, I think. We're going to do this blind style. And yeah, they're looking for me. They're very upset with us, I think. They're not pleased that there is a U-boat in the area. And I, I get that. I... I can appreciate their problem. I do. Um, in my last game yesterday, I approached a convoy of 50 to 60 and was being engaged by a German destroyer. No, Yellow, I've never seen that. Not one time. Not even once. I have never, ever, ever seen that. That is news to me, my guy. That'd be cool, though. I bet you that was pretty cool. All right, I'm going to roll forward a little bit here at speed one. Bring this guy a little bit closer to bear. Just a little, though. Not much. I'd like to get down around 600 meters, give or take. Something like that. Decon hype! There you go, my guy. There you go. I mean, you gotta do something to make it fun for yourself, right? Alright, ship to the forward. Hello, ship to the forward. I'm gonna say ship to the forward here is doing about 6.1. Is gonna be my guesstimation. No doubt it was cool, my guy. Chris Kraz, what's going on? The fear... Our unwashed bodies. There you go. Uh, Grizzly, long time. It has been a long time, my guy. Been checking it out on the YouTubes. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Much obliged. Thank you for the view. Appreciate it. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, what did I say? 6.2. We're going to hold off on distance and bearing just for a minute. Just for a little tickety tick of time. A little tickety tick of time should be okay. All right, they're starting to level out. So let's say they're doing like negative 90 or positive 270, whichever. Let's say 270, give or take. Distance to target, let's call it 660 meters. Oh, I'm typing in the wrong place. A derp, 660 meters at a 
course of approximately 275 by the time they turn. Let's get two torpedoes, impacts are fine. Accidentally hit friendly U-boat behind my target even though it dudded out them. Oh, neat. Throw. Oh, okay, got you there. Retired 100%. Saw the same thing happen near the Cardiff port. One random German destroyer. That's interesting. That's pretty cool. <laughs> My flesh will not be uh, ridden by the water, apparently. All right, we're losing the angle a little bit, but that's okay. I think we'll get it back. All right, let's punch them here. One away. Two away. Good, good, good. Where's the closest? Okay, the escorts are good ways off, so we'll uh, go ahead and load one really quick. Well, as quick as we can, anyway. As quick as we can manage, let's say. Let's put you in a command position, make everything as quiet as possible. And let's have a look here. The torpedoes look alright, they don't look bad. Uh, okay. Whoop, whoop. Yeah, got a sales of C3. I'm glad I threw two at it. I should have lowered dispersion a bit, though. Have your days and times changed? Um, yeah, they have a little bit. I now stream on Monday and Wednesdays, usually around 6 o'clock my time. Around 6. I, I shoot for 6. Sometimes I don't get on as late as uh, 6.30, but I'm... Ooh, hey, that ain't too shabby at all. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah, that went well. Flames coming up through the deck. Flames. We like fire. I like fire, I do. I think I have a little bit of an issue. With Hello? Oh, the, the man. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, no. We're sinking. We're sinking. What are you uh, about? That wasn't okay. That wasn't okay. Oh, I feel bad. I feel bad. Hang on a second here. Um, what do I remember? Da, da, da. Um, Terminator. There you go, my guy. I like that. That's a good. That's good. I think that's pretty cool. This is fine. It's just fine, right? It's good. Nobody is bothered. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. No one is upset about how that went, apparently. Even the dude that's on fire does not care. He don't care. He's fine with it. Yeah, looks like we've managed to... Ooh, is that... I bet you that is a cruiser. No, it's not. It looked like it was larger than the other ones, but okay. It's fine, it's fine. Okay, we're gonna go get this guy. Give her the same kind of treatment, I think. Time to go back to normal. True, you're not wrong. Yes, the, the time change. I keep forgetting. Are one of your mods disabling that objective to travel 2,500 kilometers? No. Nope. Because see, we, we've traveled this much of it already. Right there. I do wish they would get rid of the kilometric requirements. Uh, that's been one of my pet peeves since very, very early. Uh, since when I started playing the game anyway. I do wish they would get rid of that. I don't see it as necessary in any way. But it is what it is. Some people probably like it. I don't know. Okay. We're going to say... She's turning. So we're going to say 270. Um, we're going to say 6.2. I'd like to speed it up a little bit. Distance is... Let's call it 760 maybe. 760. All right. Give me them tubes, please. Two more tubes. Two tubes. Doop tubes. Doopy doopies. Boats! 100% there, Varkor. Uh, never mind, you're blind. Oh, well, I mean, that is a problem, isn't it? Punch him. One away. Two away. Again, should have taken dis uh, dispersion down a little bit, but that's okay. I'm going to back up uh, kind of quickly. No escorts around me. I'd like to see if I can get the rear tube fired at that guy. I'm actually going to... Let's see, let's warm up. No, let's load another tube, rather, because we're getting getting pretty light in the forward. I don't know if you guys noticed that. Um, it looks like I've got number five warmed already, which is cool. Very pleased with that. Yeah, we'll back up. 
as rapidly as we can and see if we can get a shot away at that guy back there. In real life, you should patrol constantly, not watch a map. I think the objective is, sim is to simulate that. Um, if that's the way you want to play it, yeah. The best part about this game is you get to play it however you want. I think it's very, very cool that you can play it just about any which way. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, I didn't even pay attention to the ship I shot. I'm pretty sure it's gone. Whoops. <laughs> ah. Why in Star Trek do they always have their shields down of always have... Uh, well, it's pretty simple there, T-Rex. Uh, the reason they always have their shields down, unless they're actively in a place where they require it, is because it takes power to run the shields. Vast quantities of power. So, if you have the shields on at all times, you can't root that power to doing other stuff, like sciency things, and arboretum stuff, and the holodecks, and all that kind of stuff, right? Can you give me a quick rundown on the new update for the sim? I really can't, honestly. I just skimmed it. I skimmed it myself. I've, I've gone through many, many iterations of their updates, so at this point, I just... You know. <laughs> uh, we can warm number five again quickly. I can't give you a rundown, but I'm sure somebody here in chat has got it all figured out. The plot gods demand it. There you go. Teleporting. Hey, I like it. I like it. Plot gods. All right, we're going to stop the boat there. And we should have enough time to warm this turpidu. Just nicely, even. Perfect. That's almost perfect. So from there to yay, we're looking at, oh, let's call it, yeah, let's go with 540, 540. Course looks to be about 270. Speed, 6.2 seemed to work pretty well. So let's get number five geared up and fling it out the, the rear of our boat. We'll poop it out. Want us to what against, please? I was, um, there was a question about uh, a summary of the changes coming in the next update. I do not have that information directly in front of my face, nor do I particularly remember what it said. Ergo. C3, magnetic. No, we're much too early in the war for me to be worrying about magnetic triggers. They can give me away. They can give me away. It is, of course, a, a good tactic to use magnetic triggers if you're looking to do a lot of damage with as few torpedoes as possible. However, that being said, I am more or less concerned about them not finding me right now. So we're going to stick with impacts. I had no idea what I was shooting at at the time. So we're just going to call it good. Not bad. Not bad. Little, little rear. That's okay. Dud. <sighs> Wait, magnetics give you away. Magnetics can give you away because the magnetic torpedo, the magnetic triggers, can uh, punch off early. They can punch early, so or rather they can detonate early. And if they detonate early, well, then obviously they explode in the water and they can give away wh roughly where your boat is. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully that helps you a little bit. Those guys in those positions. All right, let's let the convoy drift in. Let's let them come on in. Do some warming. I can hear all kinds of boomings. All kinds of nasty noises. Oh! What? Are those... Wait, those are... Are those enemy torpedoes? No, wait, hang on, hang on. Why were those torpedoes shown in red? What did they just sink? Is there another sub in here? see another sub in here huh that's weird isn't it mr jansen i require another torpedo to the forward please let's get this crappy t2 out of the way um i might be able to shoot this guy back here looks like we'll be far enough away forgot to see we didn't sacrifice roly 100 percent where did the saying torpedoes in the water come from and why is this so overused I mean, they probably started using it when there were torpedoes being fired at them. So, you would probably say torpedoes in the water. <laughs> uh, Mordekaiser, what's going on, my guy? Hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing just fantam-tabulous. 
Just fan tam 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 to the minimus minimus. All right, so we can shoot the one to the rear once she gets in a position for us here. Looks like we've got. Let's move forward just a little, just to give it a little extra room, because we're close to uh, kind of close to it. It's four hundred. Let's call it four hundred and fifty meters. Um, right there, four hundred and fifty. Good. Tack looks to be about two six zero. It's actually more like two six two or something, but whatever. Six point two looked like a nice, uh, a nice speed for these alarmed ships. And let's let's try out a magnetic. Let's give it a shot. I don't know what I'm shooting at, so I'm just going to shoot at three meters. That's what we're going to do right there. Let it flood up. Just found the King George the Fifth battleship. There you go. Hey, good luck there, yellow, 100%. I'm hanging in there, Mordekaiser. I am. I'm doing my very best to just hang on in there, my guy. I got some more leave coming up, so, you know, kind of waiting for that to... Oh, dear. I fired an NA-1. This might miss altogether, because they have a very shallow draft, but whatever. Soaking wet torpedoes. Makes sense to me. They'd be... I, I would hope my torpedoes would be rather damp. Looking for damp torpedoes here. 20 seconds, apparently. 10 seconds, apparently. Let's see. Ooh. All right. I'm going to have to start increasing the speed of my shots. She's an NA-1. She's basically made out of paper mache, so that's it for her. She's gone. You're done. You're done. Bye. Thank you for playing. Bye. Okay. I need to back up a little bit because i got a ship coming towards me here. How are we doing on Turpidus, fellas? We can warm two to the forward. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and do that. Imagine torpedoes over the water. I think that actually be kind of cool. But, you know, we, we actually have those. We call them missiles. <laughs> um, yeah, it's pretty much the same idea. Pretty much the same sort of thing. But they're more of a missile missile. Spread them wide, but not too wide. Oh, 100%, my guy. It's good advice. Very good advice. Yeah... Looking at maybe 800. Ooh, we're getting pinged a lot. They are pinging. They want to find me, and I don't think it's to invite me out for a drink. I really don't. Splice the main brace. I like it. Is this a neutral convoy? No. No, they have they have evil little fear mongers. Ergo, this convoy is uh, just getting shooted at. Yeah, this is going to be tight. We're going to be tight. We're going to be a little tight. Probably because we're warming a torpedo. Maybe we stop him from doing that. Go do something else. Stop warming the torpedo. I'll take my chances with what I got. Alright. She's got a bead on me. Which is less than ideal, obviously. Uh, let's go ahead and call it... 700 meters. Let's increase the speed here to 6.3. Course looks like... What? 2... 220. 220, that's what I'm going with. Give me two. Take dispersion down just a wee bit. Let's make depth 1-5. And once we fire this off, we gotta move. One away. Two away. Alright, let's get deep. Let's get deep, but let's not move just yet. Let's wait. Damn, that's loud. Ugh. That's the warship there. Yeah, we're, oh, Wasa bombs in the water. Okay, maximum go. That's exactly what I was waiting for. And hard dive. We're gonna see if we can make it through them. Max speed, max dive. Here they come. Come <laughs> on, baby. You gotta dive. You gotta dive. Ooh, boys, they're close. Treffa, we hit it. We did serious damage to it. I think we might only hit it the once. We got a miss and a hit. 
All right, we cleared the we cleared the uh, path of the depth charges. Whatever we did looks like it probably sank it, so that's a bonus. All right, we're gonna go this way until we figure out what's going on. Okay. Oh, wouldn't that have been cool if we tagged uh, whatever that escort is? That would have been awesome. Okay, just chill here for a minute. Surface and deck on them like a man. I did my time. I did my time. Pretty normal tactic if you want to make it back home. What's that? Sorry, I, I, I missed what we were talking about there. Alright, she's right to my... Why is that so loud today? Like, it's barely on. You know what I mean? Like, holy crap. It's crazy loud. Not hearing splashes yet. We're being pinged. We expected that. They're looking for us. It's okay. Bloop, 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 bloop. Okay. I think. Yeah. They, ha they don't know where I am, which is good, obviously. This guy might have me. Dead. We're not dead yet. That's the important thing. Not yet. God, that's loud. It's coming in from the forward. Coming in from the forward. Yeah. Copy ten. Wasserbomben. Wasserbomben. Okay. Schiff, Schiff. Max, go dive deeper. And turn. Let's go this way. <sighs> Might get a little shook up here. Yeah, depth charges, I hear you. Sounds close, man. Ooh. Somebody get on the engines. <sighs> All right, looks like we're okay. All right, we're gonna come up higher in the water, confuse them. They think we're deep right now. Woo! Do you speak any German? I do not. I do. I mean, I you know the basics you get from TV, Sprechen Sie Deutsch, that kind of stuff. I do not speak German though. Pinkly funk. Pinkly, I like that. It's good. All right, so their Wasabombins should be uh. Basically making it so they can't hear us, period. Let's turn this way. Yeah. Ooh-wee. Look at how many of them there are. Kill the motors here, people. Okay. Wasser bombing. I mean, you're... You know, what year is it? <laughs> Everybody always wants to know what year it is. It is 1941. January of 41, to be exact. January of 41. Ooh. Okay, we're all right. We're okay. I would have loved to get at these guys, but they made it very, very difficult. That's okay. Um, We've got a dead ship right here that we're going to deck gun at some point or another. 
Let's roll at one, and we can come up to about 50, I think. Yeah, let's do that. That's a big old convoy. We got all kinds of convoys all over the dang place. <clears throat> is that where is the bathroom? I like that. That's good. Yeah, you can use it, you know. <laughs> uh, delicious. Uh oh. That guy's being a dingus. Hey, dingus, get out of here. Go away. Go be alert somewhere else. I'm busy. I have things to do. I got stuff I need to do. I need you all to leave. It is currently dark out. So... On the bright side, it means I have to only wait until they clear about 11 kilometers. From, say, here. So I need them to go... Well, really, 7 would do it, but we're going to wait for 11. I don't want them to uh, go, Hey, there's a deck gun going off behind us, and then... Ah, there was a submarine here. Maybe they didn't see me like I thought they did. Maybe what had happened is that guy gave him the spooks. That guy gave him the spooks. I wonder who shot Red Torps. <coughs> That's what I was thinking. It's probably because um, the game didn't know where they came from technically because this guy wasn't on my map. So they probably showed up as like red, right? Who sub is it? No way to tell. It is unknown. It is an unknown thing as to where uh, or what that thing is doing. Unknown. All right. So the escorts are should be out of range now. Looks like they are, which is perfect. Let's go red lighting. Raise the boat and get prepared to shoot down a. Uh, Stricken C3. Why would you shoot anything other than the red anything other than red torps? Red is faster. 100 percent my guy. Does UBE add add other non-German subs? I believe it does, yes. I do believe it does. Didn't I see one a week or two ago? Something to that effect? Oh, sun's coming up. Yeah. You go there, you go here. And let's drive a bit. Just heading to there. Cued messages. Torpid, the entire war mock turns against you. That, that it was Germans. I mean, that does make sense, doesn't it? A Swiss Alpen sub. Why not? Why not give it a go? Let them try. Got some housekeeping to do here. And... I want to get closer to this fella. Closer to this guy. Little closer, please. Oh, yeah. This looks great. Doesn't look great. Looks great. It's burning and stuff. That's cool. That is cool. I appreciate it. Slow to one. Doodle loot, doot, doot, doodle loot, doodle loot. Doodle -loot. Oh, that's very cool. Isn't that cool? I think it looks cool. Right? Hang on. Um, kill the motors. You. Give me the gun. Point it yonder. Pause. Uh, what do I want to do? What did I want to do? That's what I wanted to do. I wanted it to look all pretty. Yeah, that's cool. That's pretty cool. It looks neat. Right? It looks good. That's the thumbnail, my guy. That is indeed the thumbnail. You're not wrong. Uh, this. Okay. Okay, let's uh, make this thing go away. Go away, please. Ooh, knocked a piece off. Hope that wasn't important. Hope they didn't need that piece. Might have been holding the boat up. I don't know. Tense and exciting? Maybe. Or, or, hear me out. It's just me playing target practice with this dead boat. Which I'm fine with, in all honesty. 
And here she goes. She's going under, baby. She's rolling. <laughs> I dropped my light. Help. Help. Chat, help. Come pick my light up for me. Chat. Uh, Damien. What is going on, my guy? Uh, nope. Don't know who that is. Don't know who that is. They're not, they don't get to talk to me if I don't know who they are. Um, you're going to keep on going down or what's, what's, what's the what? Hey, hey, here she goes. Gone. Bye. <laughs> they said I was mad. They said I was mad. What? Nothing. No, you are having a breakdown. I'm fine. You are. Okay, spin us about. Maybe we'll do some of that uh, giving people food thing that we sometimes do. Right? You know what I'm saying? Give people some foods. And escorts? There was lots of escorts. There were so many escorts. <clears throat> Weren't wrong. I mean... I mean... Got boxes in the water with fish in it. That one's got preserved pork in it. Could take those on the deck and uh, empty them out, but... Well. Eh, I have bigger fish to fry, as they say. Any water in the boat? 1.5 meters of water in my boat. Get out of the boat, water. Get out of my boat. Turn the alarm off, that'd be nice. Be pretty good idea to turn off that alarm. <clears throat> Thank you for your Ovaltine. <laughs> ah, I like that, that's good. <clears throat> do me? I'm gonna try to do me. I'll try to do me. I'm pretty good at being me, for the most part. I don't know anybody else that does it any better, so... Yeah. Um, speaking of what we do, we're gonna be taking a break here, folks. Take a little break. We're at the roughly one hour mark, so it's definitely time for a break. Uh, please feel free. Stand up. Crack your knees. Crack your back. Smoke them if you got them. Grab yourself a beverage. Whatever it is you need to do, please do those things, because uh, it's important for you guys to take care of yourselves. It just is. Um, again, we'll be back in about, oh, let's call it 10 to 15 minutes at the absolute maximum, I'm sure. And uh, when we return, we'll see what we can get done uh, here in, my, in in the sector of longness, whatever. Crack some heads, do crack, whatever. I mean, do you. I don't judge. I don't judge. We will be picking up survivors, yes. All right, folks, uh, for those of you who are going to be leaving us now during the break, I totally understand. I get it. It's a be right back screen. You can get bored. That's cool. I do stream every th uh, Wednesday and Monday. Hope to see you again in the future. For everyone's going to stick around for just a little bit. I'll see you soon. Thank you. 
You say we get right back at it. Kind of a sort of a thing as soon as the awkward black screen goes away. Uh, Nestorius, thanks for that follow. Welcome aboard. Hello, welcome to the channel. Hello. Good night, KJ. Thanks for coming by, my guy. Always a pleasure. Always a pleasure. All right, let's slow down. See if we get close enough to pick some of these dudes up. Uh, life but one. Let's, you know what? Let's stop being elitists and only taking skippers. Leaving one guy behind, that seems about right. That seems about right. I think that's best. We can't take two people on board. That's crazy. There's only two people on that lifeboat? Why were they allowed to have a lifeboat? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, what was... Let's give them a ton of... Here, have all the bread. Just take it. Take all the bread, my guy. It's fine. Lifeboat two... Why do I keep clicking on take them on board when I just filled the boat? I don't know. I just do things. I don't, I'm not, I'm not technically in charge of my brain. I, uh, you know. Thank you, V. Thanks for the stream. Gotta take, hey, thanks for coming by there, Samurai. I appreciate it. Hope you have a fantastic night. Uh, more bread for the bread gods, I guess. There we go. Whole bunch of extra reputation for yours truly. Um, let's erase this. Okay. So, let's assume they stay roughly on the same path. Maybe we'll go like this and catch up with them. Right? We do have to get a lot of stuff done. Got a lot of things to do. We need turpidus loaded and... Just so many things. Ah, uh, there's so much I can't even explain it. Okay, uh, they're having cheese and bread. That makes me sad. Let's give them eggs to go with their cheese and bread. That's, it's going to be delicious, nutritious, and uh, just downright good. Electric compressor is on. Dive planes back to electric, please, gentlemen. All right, let's see if we can catch up with that convoy again. Maybe. Just maybe. We can do a little more damage. Just maybe. I like that idea, personally. I like the idea of there being more damage to be done. Uh, that is an enemy submarine. Somehow. So, it looks like one of my submarines. But apparently it's an enemy. Uh, what the hell is that? Hello? What is it? Lifeboats. But now the lifeboats are green. And the gray sub is red. Okay. They must have had their own submarine with that convoy. I, I don't know. I don't know what to say. I just work here. I just work here. Again, I'm not really in charge. Somebody else has to take the blame, I think, personally. Because uh, it ain't going to be me. It ain't going to be me. Nah. All right. Tubes are loaded. Did we load? I think we used everything in the rear, didn't we? I think we used them up. We did. Unfortunately... You can't force them to just go back there and, like, drag it through the submarine, but whatever. Yeah, some odd stuff going on there. You're not wrong. Odd things are happening, everybody. That's kind of par for the course, in all honesty. It's kind of kind of what we do. Yeah, all right. Let's uh, see if we can catch that convoy. Should be able to see them. Should be able to see the smoke. Uh, they'd be this way, though. Oh, yeah, there they are. Hey, guys, remember me? <laughs> okay, so what are they at? My Roughly my 90, so we're basically to the side of them now. Let's get out in front. Hopefully they don't change direction on me. Should be at my... Oh, I think we're too far to see them now. They should be somewhere in this area. A little too far out now. Okay, that's all right. Let's cut in. Let's actually make sure they're not out in front of me somehow, because the game will do that to you sometimes. Just so you know. Discovered something last week. Sunk a tanker, sank without exploding, yielded six lifeboats full of sailors. Oh yeah, no, uh, a tankers don't necessarily have to have oil in them, right? They could be heading to the place where they're going to get oil, right? Friendly lifeboats. I Really? Like, it's, I don't know. Things get odd from time to time when I play this game. Um, I would expect to catch sight of the smoke now, unless they turn north, which I guess could be possible. Hmm. It's 
interesting that they're not within my sight bubble yet. Kind of intriguing. It's beginning to snow. That makes me sad. I don't like snow. And, you know, as a Canadian, I I've had my fair share of snow. Uh, not a big fan. Don't like it. Um, let's actually stop here for a little bit. Let's let the uh, convoy catch up to us, maybe. Because I feel like I should see them by now. Hello? Where'd the convoy go? Okay, you all saw the smoke, too. Like, they're, they were here, right? What is happening? Convoy. Where did you go? Hello? All right, let's let a little more time go by, I guess. I'm not really... Okay. Uh, we're in a full-on storm now. Which is less than good. Because uh, our visibility has gone to basically nothing. But I see smoke on the horizon. Okay, let's uh, move. Let's move a little. See what we can find. Could use hydrophones. I don't really want to dip if I don't have to. Is that my 20? Let's go speed 4. Still at my 20, give or take. Okay. Uh, we might be able to work with this. I'm guessing about 15 kilometers or so. Let's go like 2 kilometers forward. Give or take. Now it's at my 10. Okay. We're gonna, we're gonna stop here for a minute. Just let the game do its thing for a few minutes. Okay. Where are they at now? Now they're out in front of me. Okay. Let's get moving as best we can. To the forward just a little. High rate of speed. Still out in front. Thinking now is a good time to dip the boat. Let's go to blue lighting, conserve oxygen. And we'll get the big ears up and running. Whoa, I don't think they're that far away, are they? It says anywhere within 14 kilometers, though. So that's a large amount of bad. 12 kilometers now. 12.8 kilometers. That's a large, large, large area. Maybe my handy-dandy telescope thing here will uh, help me out. Assuming they're going to be ahead of us. Somewhere. Um... Hmm. Most of the noise is forward. Forward-ish. Um, Tankcraft. Hello. Welcome for, or thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Ah, this is what I'm picking up. There's a single out in front of me. That's why everything's so janky. Cool. Okay. All right. All right. We got some time to kill here. Let's stop the motors there for a minute. What we could do is go to alarm status. That'll give me the aha. Good. The ability to extend my range. We want, I think, to back up. Pretty sure here. And we also want to begin torpedo warmings. The warmings of torpedoes, one might say. Now, where will the escorts be? Anyone's guess is just as good as mine. Definitely want to back up a little bit. Because the edge of the convoy is technically to my rear at this point. So we can't fire rear tubes because we don't have any. Ergo. Kill the motors there. Alright, need to back up a little more. A little more. I want to give myself some space to work with here. Okay, kill them there. Oh, no, more. Even more. More, more, more. Here we go. Now we're talking. 
All right, this will do it here, I think. <clears throat> Pardon me, sorry. Let's keep warming a high pri- Ooh, bad. That's bad. That's not exactly what I wanted to see there. We're going to move it three really rapidly. We're going to have to get deeper into the convoy because this guy's going to roll right over my head. Definitely playing with- Why are you not doing your job? You're not doing your job. That is not your job. You're supposed to be warming Torpedo 3. Come over here and warm it. You bad man, you. Can't move too much because that guy's real close. All right, shut it down there. We'll let some of the convoy go by, let him go by, and then we'll uh, do our thing. <clears throat> That's what we're going to do. I want somebody on depth keeping. That's what I want. I want you to warm that torpedo as quickly as possible, please. Okay, good. Now. <sighs> Just got out of over 12 hours of DC and combat system drills. Oh, my dude, that sucks. That sucks, my guy. I feel your pain, I do. Start getting some values with my stat witch. We'll get a 315 timing. We want to be accurate. We don't have uh, visibility, really. We got like, I don't know, 300 meters of viz, if that. So. Definitely going to want to uh, be careful with our timing. 315 seems to be appropriate. We are going to back up a little more. This is not smart, but we are going to back up a little bit more. Just because I want a little more room here. Not much, but I want the torpedoes to have enough run time to arm. It would be poopy if they did not arm. Uh, I was going to say, are we even moving? Holy crap, all right. This is the first minute, right? It hasn't gone by yet. I didn't miss it. Pretty sure this is the first minute. I'm not good at concentrating. I don't know if anybody caught that, but uh, yeah. All right, so that's one minute there. Let's kill the motors here. We're tempting fate as it is with this guy. I'd like to shoot him. Maybe move forward and try to shoot him or back up. Depends on what this guy does. If he turns in on me immediately, I think forward is going to be the best thing to do. Try to get at him. I could wait, though. I could wait until this guy's completely past me. Back up slowly, work on this guy and this guy. That might be smarter. Where's the enemy sub? I don't know. I don't know. The enemy, not enemy sub. It's, it's around here somewhere. Bring me closer. I want to hit it with my sword. All right, that's one minute 50. Pretty sure, anyway. My navigation correctness is dropping rapidly. That's not good. Okay, so that's the two minute mark there. One minute and ten seconds left for an accurate speed representation of this convoy, which will also give me its course. Because it's awesome like that. One minute left of the timing. Oof, loud. It's just noise. You know? Wonder, like, man, you had to be, you must have had to be so good to pick out individual targets, right? <sighs> oh well. I will never be that man, I'm sure of it. This is a large convoy, people. 25 to 57. Hmm. Oh yeah, you're, o you're almost always being pinged. So they'll just ping and ping and ping every now and again. Uh, we haven't been detected, everything's cool. Mother. Thanks, Rick. Back with a bang. Very good, my guy. All right, we got about five seconds. Two, one, bang. Got it. So many mini corn dogs. Necron, what's going on, my guy? Hope you're doing well. All right. Yeah, Scallywag is exactly right. 
Um, six hundred seventy. So she's doing six point seven. Course is. Oop, thingy disappeared before I could unthing it. There we go. Course ears. That's not helpful. You're supposed to be this thing. Be this thing when I'm doing stuff. You're embarrassing me in front of my friends. Just saying. Negative 9.6 is our ship's course. And what was it again? 6.7? Alright, let's enter it for this. This is going to be 6.7 for a speed. Negative 9.7. Distance will be following at some point. Let's let this nasty, uh, nasty, wascally wabbit here get past me. Or at least to the side of me so I can back up a bit. Yeah. Or maybe we move forward now. Open up for a shot here and here. <sighs> no. I say we back up. We back up now. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Speed one is all we need, people. Speed one is all we need. All right, she's basically ahead of me now, so we'll get going on torpedoes again. Nice and easy. Get a roughly a kilometer out in front of us. Roughly. Easy, easy. Alright, that's about a K there. Love it. Love it. Um, put you on depth keeping. Let's come up to let's come up to periscope depth. See if we can actually see something. When I told my right wife she should embrace her mistake, she thanked me and gave me a big hug. That's a good one, Shade. That is a good one, my guy. I like that. Like it a lot. Alright. Dive planes to manual. We are getting some sight, not much. All right, did I say we could shoot that guy? Let's shoot this guy. So this guy's distance is, you know what, we could probably, can we see it? I'm not sure if we can see it or not. No, we can't see it. Periscope depth is useless. All right, bring it down to two zero. Maximum torpedo depth. Distance to forward target, 1116. 1116. Torpedo to the forward. Two times triggers, or sorry, two times torpedoes. Bring dispersion down to 23. Depth of 1 5. Impact is fine. And once they're done flooding, we'll let them go. How's the hunting? Not bad, honestly, not bad at all. Ran into a big old convoy. Just a great big fella. Firing torpedoes. One away. Two away. Good. Uh, Mr. Jansen, please load a torpedo for me, sir. It makes noise, I'm aware, but everything should be okay. Alright, those little fishies are streaking off towards target nicely. 30 seconds to torpedo impact, apparently. I'll believe it when I see it, mind you. Oh, no. It's an NA-1. One of these is going to miss because it's tiny. Curses. Been really sick. That sucks, my guy. Must oh, no doubt, dude. That sucks. Sorry to hear that, my guy. Very sorry to hear that. Hope you get well. Hope you get well. Boom. And a dud. Yeah, she's sinking. She's going right to the bottom, baby. Right straight to the bottom. All right, bring it on. Bring it on, bring it on. We got this fella right in front of us. Just teed up, ready to go. Let's move forward a bit. Um, It looks like there are no escorts near me, so Mr. Jansen is going to load me another torpedo. Yes, please. What is this? Yeah, that's a liberty. I like liberties. They go kaboom in a very nice way. They most certainly do. Get a big old boomer. Alright, my friend. You will have slowed down a fair bit. 
I'm going to go ahead and pretend it's uh, 6.2. That worked out well last time. 6.2. Angle is 270. Distance to target is approximately 510 meters. Two times torpedoes. Rock and roll. Let's spread them out a little bit. 30. Yeah. It's been a while since I've seen Tyler too, my guy. It has been some time. He's a busy man, you know. Yeah, T2s are the worst. They're terrible. We're going to back up quickly. I want to get this this fella right here. 30 seconds. Hello. My... What's, what's the flag here? Is it French or Dutch? I don't know what the flag is. I'm bad at flags. I always have been. Not good with flags. I don't get it. Not good at remembering that kind of stuff. Especially when there's no pictures. Like, my flag has a picture. Boom! Looks like we had another dud. Yep, another dud. That sucks. That's poopy. Makes That makes me unhappy. That's okay. We'll tee up on this fella. Or tee up on their little buddy. You know, I'm tempted to fire again. Let's... Yeah, let's fire again. At, no, she's abandoned. Never mind. She's abandoned. I don't have to shoot her again. She'll just float there or sink. One of the two. Alright, kill the motors here, maybe. Torpedoes are warmed. Mr. Jansen, can we load any more? We cannot. These are our last two fishies. <coughs> Upside down Netherlands. There you go, my guy. Could be Dutch. I don't know. Um, What did I miss here? DZ. What are we talking about? Didn't know that. What should I use? Um, The best torpedoes in the game are T3s. Once you get... There's this dude again. Oh, my lord. They appear to know where I am. I'm going to get deeper. Deeper, please. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, this, this changes everything. This changes all the things. Let's close the bulkheads, people. We're in trouble. I'm in a little bit of trouble here. Because that guy, I think, knows exactly where I am. Let's get deeper. Pretty sure. Jesus. And for 1940, use T1s, man. <laughs> T1s are better than T2s. T1s are better than T2s. Everything is better than T2s. You could throw rocks. Oh, he doesn't know where I am. Can I get up to 20 meters fast enough to sink this boat? I might be able to. Come on, baby. Rise, rise, rise. Rise. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. Oh, my God. I've, I think I've got time. I think I have time if I use magnetic triggers. Oh, bibs and bobs. Okay. 6.2 worked great. Course is almost exactly 270. Distance to target is, let's call it 360. 360. Both tubes. Make them magnetic. Send them deeper. Down to three. Let's go three, five. Why not? I don't even know what I'm shooting at. Whew, shotgun range. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. I just hope they uh, arm. They should. Punch them. One away. Two away. Oh, it's a... Okay. I thought it was a Liberty. It's an Empire. That's okay. That's all right. It's the Empire Florian. The Florian. With any luck, she's going to be on the floor soon. <laughs> Boom. Incoming. Another dud, man. Woo. I'm getting the duds today. I am getting the duds today, everybody. That is a thing. We're getting those duds. We're all about those duds, apparently. He has an idea that we're in the area. Ooh, this could be trouble. 
This could be trouble right here. Hey, buddy. He's drifting. He's drifting. You leave those barrels on the deck, you bugger. Don't be dropping no depth charges on my head. Yeah, the dreaded NPC. You're not wrong. Rolly owes me. What's the difference between T1 and T3? A T1 is a steam-driven torpedo. A team 3 is an electrically driven torpedo. She's right overhead. She's right overhead. Is who Greek? Who's Greek? This guy? This guy appears to be... Is that Greece? I don't know. It's like blue with a cross in it. It could be Greece. <clears throat> Certainly could be Greece. Alright. I think we're okay. That unknown submarine still doing unknown submarine things. Just saying. He's doing stuff. I don't like it. I don't like it that he does stuff. He should do anti-stuff. By anti-stuff, I mean leave me alone. That's what he should be doing, is leaving me alone. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There was a lot of destroyers in this convoy. Just saying. They, uh, they were not messing about. They were not messing about. It is Greek? There you go. That sub is definitely some kind of escort. But... Sub-to-sub -sub warfare is certainly not a thing in 1940. Because all I gotta do is go deeper than 20 meters and they can't shoot at me, so. Not dumping depth charges on me, so that's a bonus. Liking that. Another Greek fella. Okay. You go do your thing, my guy. I got stuff to do myself. Speed one, 50 meters. Yeah. 50 plus is your record on escorts. 50 plus. What does that mean? Sorry, what does the number mean? 50 plus. Um, come 20. So we are in a storm that'll protect us from being detected now. Let's give them 7 kilometers of distance. Say there-ish. And then we'll uh, pop up and say hello to this guy. <coughs> sorry, sorry. <clears throat> it's that nasty cough. Nasty little cough I got there. Won't go away forever. Forever. Alright, he's almost out of the circle now. Let's get a little more gas. And yeah, we're pretty solid here, I think. Let's come on up out of the water, please. Out of the water, if you don't mind. I have things I wish to do. Don't need that. So let's get on the radio. Coming on up in the world. Red lighting engaged. Hello, Liberty. Hello, my friend. I am going to make you not be on top of the water anymore. Sorry, but it's a thing. Uh, deck gun would be nice. Why can't I use the deck gun? There it is. Just didn't, didn't populate for a while. Hello. Once again, we got that, what was it again? Did we, did we figure it out if it was Dutch or French or what? I don't know. Skipper's heading for the gun. We're sending in three times messages. Pretty much ready for a fourth message here momentarily. Yes, we're very close. 100%. Escort's turning up to hunt you from previous... Ha 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 ha! No doubt, my guy. I like it. Um, compressor, please. That should be running, I think. Skipper's on the gun. Come on, skip. Oh, that's pretty. Sunlight streaming through. Isn't that gorgeous? Huh? It is drifting a bit. It is. We're gonna be careful. I do know, as a matter of fact, if you're, like, basically on top of them, and you fire the deck gun, the splash damage from the round can kill your people. Don't ask me how I know that. I'm just saying I do. Boom. Hello? Did you reload? Boom. That ought to do it. Oh, yeah, here she goes. Here she goes. 
Give me speed one. There we go. She's gone. Send the comms. Oh, picked up something too. Um, it's an encoded message from one of the, uh, one of the foxtrots. Copy of Oliver Twist just fell on my toe. It hurts like the Dickens. Oh, shade. Never change. We're not bothering with light boats anymore. We're done with that. I've moved on with my life. I'm no longer, no longer interested. Oh, that submarine's back. We may want to dive. He's over here. He's doing stuff. It's British. It's a British submarine. I can see the little flag here. Apparently it's underwater. Maybe we should be underwater too. Um, let's give it a minute. He doesn't seem to know what the hell he's supposed to be doing right now. He's over here. Oh, oh, he turned. Hang on. Dive to 50. Dive to 5 0. Bloop. Because we got a, we got a M, M &E submarine. Yes, that's the same large group of ships. I don't know if you knew that, but okay. Uh, mm, did anyone ask how the family affair went? If they did, I missed it. Oh, you mean my uh, trip up to, to visit my folks? Uh, yeah, people asked about that on Monday. It was a good little trip. It was a fantastic little trip. I enjoyed myself. And I've also just spilled foam onto my shirt. It's very professional. I, I, I am the best. Is this new update? No, it's not out yet. No, it is not. This is not the update, my friend. It is not. Uh, turn the alarm off. We don't need that anymore. Yeah. Yes, the UBE mod. It is modly. Modeled, one might say. Alright, we gotta move. Gotta get them kilometers done. Once we're far enough away from this crap, it'll let me go quick. Again. Uh, that whole, uh, you can't use high time compression when you're close to ships thing, that's gotta go too. That's good. It's not good. I understand it if you're beside an enemy ship, but like, lifeboats are not ships. Let's all learn from this experience and move on, shall we? Lifeboats ain't ships. Um, we're running out of air. I should probably come to the surface. That might be a good idea. Let's do that. Let's bring the boat up, please. Um, yeah, they were talking about March. I don't think that's happening. April's a possibility for the testing betas that they're talking about, I, I would imagine, but other than that, a ship. Really? I'm intrigued. What kind of ship? A shippy ship? I don't see a ship. Uh, okay. Maybe I'm crazy. I might be crazy. Let's open the bulkheads back to electric dive planes. Valentine, what's going on? It's been a little while, Val. Hope you're doing well. 34 months, Val. 34 months in a row of your life belongs to me. And I thank you for each and every one of them I do. I'm going to use both compressors here. All right. The ship that supposedly I saw is not here anymore. So... wonder if it was that sub... I don't know. Um, bring back the tomato plant. I'll, you know what? I'll consider it. I'll consider it. Miss the stream. Watch the Monday show. Awesome. 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 Busy doing chem homework. Hey, that's totally fine, Val. You, you do your homework, please. Much more important than whatever nonsense it is I'm up to, for sure. Why can't I use high time compression yet? What is going on here? Not sure what's happening, but okay. Can't wait for the full game. I think you're going to be waiting a bit, to tell you the truth. Um, with the decision for them to launch, like, uh, beta testing, I think we're in for the long haul, for the most part. But whatever. Late April for beta testing, probably for a month, then we'd be in May. Need a month to do. Oh, 100%. Um, I would love for this dev team to, to do the unexpected and release... 
the game after the bugs are fixed. Like, don't release it and then go, oh, well, there's going to have to be a patch or whatever. Like, let them do the beta testing, fix the game, and then let's talk about releasing it. You know what I mean? Like, just to break the mold a little bit the way it used to be, where the game had to come out, right? That was that was better, I think. Um, this guy's going to have to work for a while. Because my navigation correctness is all kinds of poopy. It's not good. It's not good. It's not good. It's bad. It's bad. Would just stick. Stop. Oh, you. Ooh, you know what? You're going to work until you die. I, I don't care. I want navigation correctness higher. I want it much higher. Stop losing your person. Quit it. Tisk. Tisk, I say. Tisk. And tisk again. And dare I say it, tisk once more. Stop it. Keeps on losing a sailor. Probably because the sailor that I, I'm giving him just comes out of the pool and they're probably designed to go do something with somebody else. So. All right, Mr. Kid. Oh, look at all the water in the boat. Jeez. Jeez. So much water. Almost three meters of water in my boat. That's gross. That's gross. Not that patient. Well, I mean, I've been waiting for them to release this game since 2019. So. <laughs> That's when I picked up my first, uh, picked up the copy for the first time. I think it was, um, it was either late B124 or early B125 when I started playing this game, so. It's been a little bit. <clears throat> weird little blue ring for no reason. There it is. Gotta love those weird blue rings for no reason. They're the best. What a beautiful day for sailing. A little bit of chop. Nothing extraneous. Fix bugs before the update, otherwise old bugs become the lowest in the pile. Exactly, my guy. And honestly, I hope they don't bother releasing it until they do some um, optimization for the graphics. Yeah. Remember when it came out in 2019? Yep, yep. All right, we have completed this patrol, everybody. This patrol is in the bag. We killed it. Killed it. I can't wait to see what kind of tonnage we got. I really can't. Four days later. Don't know where I even seen the game. I wish I knew who to blame. <laughs> there you go. Game switch comment. Have you seen the new updates for police? Sim I noticed that there is an update, but I haven't gotten around to, to looking at it yet. Beware of burnt Easter eggs. Beware of burnt Easter eggs. That's really good. That's fantastic, my guy. Listen, dude, I appreciate you oh so very much. Me and 1950s Godzilla, of course. Uh, cannot, cannot, cannot understand uh, your generosity to to uh, whatever this is. Uh, appreciate it, Rick. Appreciate them, them, them ten dollars, my guy. I do. Um, police sim sale. Oh, releasing a highway DLC. Oh, kind of. Uh, I'll have to look into it. All right, Cosmic B picked up some points. Good for you, Cosmic. Skipper gets a medal, because Skipper is Skipper, and officers are better than you. That's just how it is, okay? I don't know what to tell you. We all have to live in the same world. All right, level three of the assault on British uh, shipping is almost complete. We're about 22 and a bit thousand tons away. Some newspapers for a while. All right. The G.O.H. Jones uh, was heading from Liverpool to Halifax with oil. Apparently, I sank an oil tanker. I didn't even know it. Crazy. 6,317 tons out of the UK. I learned how to tell AOB by I. There you go, my guy. Uh, the Crombie, 2,240 tons, transporting valuables to Halifax. Interesting. Okay. Crombie was sunk, and everybody's clapping for us, so that must be good. Right? That's a good thing. The Catherine. She was heading to Halifax with more valuables. 2,220... Uh, sorry. 2,238 tons. More clapping. This must have been a big one. Must have been a big one. Some shots miss. There you go, my guy. That's all you need. As long as you're hitting more than missing, it's all good. The Arndale was heading to Halifax with food in the hold. I wonder why they'd be shipping food to Halifax. 
That's strange. 7,807 tons. Not bad. Um, another ship with food on it heading for Halifax, 2,248 tons. The Florian was taking valuables yet again, 5,979 tons. Okay. Florian, once again, is a clappity clap, clap, clap. Okay. The Rosina Topic was taking raw resources to Halifax. She was Yugoslavian. Wow, that's crazy. 7,204 tons. Wow. Still think when Das Boot is the I still think when Das Boot is the best movie about submarines. I mean it's certainly the best movie about U-boats. I'll give you that for sure. 100 percent Totally nick those medals. 100 percent I stole them. I straight up stole them, and I don't even feel bad. Don't even feel bad. I'm fine with it. Okay, a single outing, no reloads, no nothing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ships, including an oil tanker that I didn't even know I shot, so that's pretty cool. Uh, we picked up another leader and 12,000 budgets, which is not too shabby. A lot. Ooh, level ups. I do like some level ups. Mr. Schaefer, our radio guy. Let's see what we can get you, my dude. Hmm... Let's do medical coordinator for Mr. Schaefer. Yeah. And Mr. Dalhouse here. He is our mechanic y kind of guy. He's got thorough already. Um recovering scrap might be good. Ooh, loading torpedoes 33% faster. I'm all about that noise. I can't even explain to you. Yeah. Heinz watched Das Boot when it came out. There you go, my guy. Rock and roll. Party, party. So I want to save here. Because, of course, everybody, this brings us to the end of tonight's stream. Folks, I had a lot of fun tonight. I really did. Um, to tell you the truth, I'm surprised I did. Because I was having one of those evenings where uh, I wasn't feeling it. You know what I mean? Like, uh, not that, you know, streaming is terrible, but... <clears throat> it was just one of those nights I wasn't really feeling myself. I felt a little bit off. Work was fine today. Nothing really major happened. It was just one of those days where I was like, oh, okay, I got to get this done. Come on now. Come on. You know what I mean? Like, and not exactly had to force myself into it, but like had to like fight through a little bit of like, I don't know, ennui, if you're, if you're, if you're familiar with the term. Just had a little bit of a, a little bit of ennui, I, I, I find, yeah. Um, no worries there, DZ. You can you can check out the start uh, right there on my YouTube channel, or you can watch it here on Twitch, 100%. It wasn't... I don't know if it was bugless or not, because I saw lifeboats that were definitely red, and then they turned green. I saw a submarine that was gray, and then turned red. So, bugless? Can't say. Lots of duds tonight. Three or four, I think. And I'm using upgraded triggers, so that's... Really poopy. It's not good at all. Not very good at all. Randy, thank you very kindly for your viewership, my friend. And the red torpedoes. You're not wrong. Uh, torpedoes sank an enemy or one of the enemy vessels. They came out of nowhere, and they were enemy torpedoes somehow. I don't. I have no idea what was going on there. I'm thinking that was a bug. I'm pretty sure that was a bug, but it is what it is. Russian torpedoes. I like it. I like it. They were Russian torpedoes fired from a British submarine. Because when I clicked on the the sub later, when we ran into it a second time, it definitely showed its nationality as British. So it was a British submarine, apparently, that had enemy torpedoes that sank the enemy ships. So I don't know what the hell was going on there. I don't know what's going on. Don't get it. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. Long story short. Listen, folks, again, I had fun tonight. I'm really glad uh, I sat down and uh, you all got to join me, and it was fun. I, I, I had some fun, and honestly, I think that's going to propel me for the rest of the night, so that's definitely a bonus. Never straighten out the submarine being red when you have the red lights on at sunrise and sunset. Yeah, I've even had the boat get Technicolor, like RGB. I've had the boat get green accents as if it was nuclear. It was crazy. Another good afternoon show. Thank you very kindly there, Wolfgang. I'm glad you enjoyed it, my guy. V, take it easy, my dude. Rick, 100%, dude, 
Listen, folks, until next time, I have been lightly salted. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. Bye now.